Hi everyone, I'm Heidi and I am in the Shape Your Future Healthy Kitchen sponsored by T-Set. I am here with Chef Val from the OUTU School of Community Medicine. Thank you for being here. I know we're talking holiday, Easter is upon us. So what's, some, what's a healthy side? I think that's what we're talking about today, right? right. So chances are you're going to be asked to come to a, a holiday dinner mm -hmm. or you're going to host it yourself. And I mean, maybe you want to bring the one healthy thing that's going to be served <laughs> right. that day, right? The traditional meal is great, but it's right. always nice to have some healthy things in there. Okay, so we are going to make a quinoa spinach salad. And okay. so we have some quinoa that's still very hot. And we're going to add some spinach to that just so um, it wilts a little bit. Okay. And that's and just been steamed, correct? Yes, the okay. quinoa has been steamed, the spinach is fresh, and we're just going to stir it all together. So, like I said, it kind of wilts down a little bit, maybe just a little bit at a time. We might add a little bit more here in a minute. But also what's going to go in here is a vinaigrette, and this is just olive oil, vinegar, you can choose your vinegar, red wine vinegar, okay. apple cider vinegar, um, and you know, you could even use lemon juice on this and choose a vinegar that you like the acidity because some are a lot more sour than others. So we're going to okay. go with that for now. And again, you kind of can adjust to your personal taste or your totally. family's taste. Totally. And this has Dijon mustard in it. You could not do any mustard at all. It does help emulsify the um, vinaigrette though, helps it okay. stay together. Um, so we're using red onion, Always with our recipes, use white onion, use green onion, don't use onion, right. whatever you like. <laughs> Make um, everybody happy. Right, so this is walnuts. You can add walnuts, pecans, you know, go crazy with whatever mm -hmm. kind you like. Um, dark raisins, you could use golden raisins, you could use dried okay. cranberries, any kind of um, dried fruit that you like. And that's just gonna get tossed together. I just like how flavorful it always looks like when you do things like this. So this is a, a kind of a family hit and it's super delicious, super health, healthy, and I do like to serve it warm like this, but it's okay. also just as delicious or even more so the next day. So store it in the refrigerator, pull it out, then you have lunch for a couple of days because it does make kind of a lot. So we're still going to go in with a so little bit more spinach. either or, hot or cold. Mm -hmm. Yep, totally. And then also delicious with a little grilled fish or chicken okay. um, on top of it also. So this is just going to get all tossed together. You make it more of your entree that way. Yes. Right, just the basis for some other protein. Tofu, sauteed tofu is also delicious. Does it make a difference if you do the quinoa ahead of time or you need to do it day of, anything like that? Um, I mean, it's not like it's gonna ruin it or anything, but I do definitely like that the hot quinoa steams and breaks down the spinach just a little bit. So this is ready to go. Oh my goodness, it smells amazing. <laughs> I wish you could, you could smell it like I do. And also fresh fruit would be a really good addition to this too. Okay, so you so, can really play with it and make yeah. it your own. Berries, apples, pears, all would be delicious. And we can just make a little serving sure. of this right here and you can taste it if you'd like. Yes, I need to taste it. It looks amazing. I've already got my fork ready. Okay, we're ready. <laughs> all right, it looks so good. I'm just sneaking a part of the quinoa here. Oh, so good. Good. Very, very good. If you guys need this side dish for Easter or any time, Go to our website, kjrh.com.